What is going on, everyone? Happy New Year. Um, well, yeah, it is. Oh, my. Excuse the trim. I've just been at work uh, for the first part of this video. Uh, so I'm just walking home now. It's currently about half past 10. But yeah, like I said, Happy New Year. Hope everyone's doing well, ready to get ready with 2022. Hopefully, a better year than the past two have been AIDS. But yeah, anyway, so what I'm going to take you through today is like a full day of eating. I haven't done one in a while. The last one I did was like a 15,000 calorie challenge, which went down quite well. Uh, but yeah, there's quite a new, quite a lot of few new people here now. So I'm gonna take you through my full day of eating. I'm currently on a lean ball. You know, I need to get my shit back together after Christmas. It's been a, I've hit it hard over Christmas. The eating hasn't been good. Training hasn't been that good either. And um, yeah, I've been drinking an awful lot of alcohol. So it's time to get uh, back to back to what I, I like to do. Get back into a schedule, back eating well, and uh, finish off two more months of this ball. So yeah, if you want to hit that like video, if you're new, subscribe. And yes, get into it. Uh, meal number one, I guess. Bagels as always. Let's go. And there we have it. Meal number one. Two ham and egg and cheese, actually, bagels. Um, and butchered that one. It's stuck to the pan. But yeah, that is meal number one. I'll probably put the macros and calories like here-ish. But yeah, that is meal number one. I have this every single day. It is probably my favourite meal, to be honest. But yeah, I'm going to scram this down and get it going. I also put some uh, ketchup on it. You know, not too bothered about tracking my sauces. I don't put loads on. I just gotta have ketchup with this meal, but a bit of a taste test. It just doesn't get old. We are gonna scram this now, and I'll talk to you after. So that's meal number one um, done. So I'm gonna go blah 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 blah. Gonna go make meal number two now. Meal number one is normally my pre-workout meal, but I'm training a bit later today. Um, I do normally train around about 12 o'clock-ish, about, oh, no, about half 12-ish normally. I normally have that around about 11. I don't like training on a full stomach and I can never eat when I first wake up. Um, so I prefer to save my food for later on. But yeah, I'm going to go make meal number two now. This will probably be my pre-workout meal. I might be able to squeeze another one in, depends what time I go. Uh, but yeah, probably, I'll let you know anyway. So yeah, I'm going to go make that now. So chicken baguette. Very simple, put chicken in the oven, spice it up, put a baguette in the oven, mix it together. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go make that now and I'll show you what it looks like. So yeah, meal number two. So here is the chicken baguette. We've got 200 grams of chicken, no, 230 grams of chicken with some sriracha sauce. Obviously that's going to go on top of there and some lightest Philadelphia spread. Couldn't have it without this. This is unreal. Good calories as well, look. That's 30 grams is a lot of calories as well. So yeah, I'm going to eat this now. Post pre-workout meal, lovely stuff. Right, it's half five and I'm back from the gym. So I'm running a bit late behind meals. I've still got three to get in, but I've just made the next one. So this is a post-workout meal. It's a big one, it's a big one. Probably the biggest meal of the day. Uh, very, very filling, but I'm gonna show you what I've got. We have got 100 grams of uh, raw weight rice. Raw weight rice? Raw weight rice. We have 250 grams of 5% fat pork mince and loads of veg in there. Again, sriracha on top. Of course. And then, yeah, I'm going to eat this. So it's a great post-workout meal. High protein, high carb. Just what you want. And it also... Tastes unreal. Mm. So yeah, I'm going to scram this now. And then I'll talk to you after. And get on to... Meal number four. I'm going to be bloated tonight, but... Gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, meal number four. We have got some frosties with protein milk. It's very, very simple. Not much to it, really. Just a nice quick meal, get some carbs in. I normally have that post-workout, but it's later on in the day, so I wanted that for tea, if you get me. Um, so yeah, num meal number four, I'm gonna quickly whip it up now. There's not much to it, like I said. It's literally frosties. So yeah, I'm gonna put it into a bowl, show you. It's a big bowl, to be fair. So yeah, are you ready? <laughs> oh, look at that. That is just what you wanna see, isn't it? Jeez. But yeah, because of that goal, I forgot to record this. Um, as I was making it, I ran in here, because they scored. And then I ate it, so I forgot to show you, but literally it was a bowl of frosters, like there's not much to it. Um, so yeah, that was meal number four. So I'm gonna chill out for a bit now. The darts final is on, get in, so I'm gonna get all comfy. Watch that, and then I'll catch you at the last meal, meal number five. So I normally do space these meals out a bit more, uh, but I'm just, just, I don't know, I was not timed it very well today. I was a bit late for my first meal, which kind of set me back a bit, so yeah. <coughs> <coughs> I haven't got COVID, I swear. I'm going to go and chill out now. I'm going to watch the darts, like I say. Chill out a bit. And meal number five, which I'm not sure how to make it. It's oats. But me, they're just going to have protein oats or my protein cookie. So you'll see when I get there. Feeling good. Good to be back on diet, finally. Training went well. Training pushed today. 
and my numbers were mint like i proper went up on them which i'm actually quite surprised about but yeah gonna uh, chill out now i've said chill out so many times reflect on my push session and chill from there what is wrong with me i'm making a protein cookie so 120 grams of oats 20 grams of protein i've got that flavor lob into this bowl mix it up and put it on a baking tray and cook it with some banana pretty simple should look like that and in there for about 15 minutes and voila look at that bad boy and there we have it pour some honey on top and there's 130 grams of oats with 20 grams of protein very very nice i want to scram this just watching the darts come on michael smith who just start to pull it back is what we'd love to see but yeah oh, yeah. oh get in but yeah here we go i'm gonna scram this and i'll talk to you after really nice it's better than protein oats i think okay then that is the video there so we we'll finished it off with about 3750 calories i was eating about 4k before but i'm just loaning them a little bit because i just look i oh, got a text I looked a bit shit around Christmas. Uh, well, I look a bit shit after Christmas. So I just took 250 off. Just so I'm still gaining, but just just to ease up a little bit. I'll get back to 4,000 probably next week or something like that. But we're just having a week, a little bit lower. Uh, so I finished the day. Oh, it was a high protein day. 268 grams of protein, which is way too much, but it is what it is. Um, nothing's the same. Sad for the upgrade to the main. Oh, God. Um, and then 503 carb and 54 grams of fat. So a lot of protein probably should i'm gonna i wouldn't normally have that much protein i don't know why it came out like that uh but i normally have higher carb less protein than that uh fat's normally like that i'm not really too bothered about fat so that stays the same but yeah that's the video there so three thousand three thousand seven hundred fifty that will come up to four thousand and then i'll do another video four thousand calories just to show you what that's like but yeah thank you for watching uh like subscribe and i'll see you in the next one